Hey guys, welcome back to another video and today I am doing a review of some Bakugan Evolutions which is the fourth, the fourth season of Bakugan and uh, well, this I haven't really been able to get my hands on Bakugan Evolutions and when I saw these packs at store I was quite excited and there was a lot of res and I did quite a big haul. I got this pack I got um, Diamond Platinum Sectonoid, Elemental Platinum, Platinum Blitz Fox, and a couple of other packs. So I'm going to start off with this one. And yeah, so let's get into it. This pack comes with Diamond Sepilius Ultra, or Ultra Sepilius because they changed the names. Diamond Colossus and Diamond Neo Dragonoid. And uh, if you're looking on store shelves, then you should keep an eye out for this golden, um, almost like ribbon on the side because uh, it tells you if it's rare or not. And it just makes it easier to find these packs in store. And you can see the art here, Bakugan Evolutions logo. Three Bakugan, six cores and seven cards. Of course, three being character cards. Three being Diamond Evos and one Gate Card. Then you can see the Bakugan here. Just some more stuff. So I'll get the box opened and we'll have a look. Right, so here it is out of the box. And yes, yeah, Apilius is my favourite Bakugan. So I was really excited to get this pack. And some two really good other Bakugan. So, I will have a look at these cards. Um, there's this leaf fillet thing, explains the rules. Nothing that exciting. Then they have the, um, collect, the collection leaflet. You can see old Bakugan. Evil Rare Prisma Dragonoid, which I believe is coming to store shelves soon. Gate card. We have Fenica there. And Helix. We have the Helix core symbol there. And of course, 100, 200, 800, 400, 0, and 300. And there's that side. And then if I just take all these cards, you can see Diamond Evos cards. So I'll start off with Colossus. So Colossus is a double fire fist. This is the Heroes version, which is the native faction. 800 B, 3 damage. Really nice Bakugan. Then we take a look at the Diamond Evo. This is 3, three cost, 3 energy. 1200 B and 7 attack. Nice. And Evolutions has uh, low cost Evos, so that's nice. And two Fire Fists, minus five damage, which is really bad. Then the best Fire Fist core, plus 250B and plus three damage. So I will just roll this out. It looks quite nice. And the magnet is here, so I'll just open that. And there we have this mold. Quite nice. I really love these new evolutions colors. We have those patterns. It's nice silver paint, blue, head sculpt. Really quite nice. Of course, this is not a platinum. So, quite nice there. Then we'll have a look at. Neo Dragonoid and one of the biggest most annoying things about Bakugan Evolutions is we get a lot of mispackages and misprints this is Neo Dragonoid we get the Dragonoid card which is kind of annoying which means you can't really use this Bakugan because it has the wrong card. And the Evo, 
is diamond trachonoid, so diamond neo trachonoid doesn't really exist. I mean, the mold is diamond neo trachonoid, but we're getting a diamond trachonoid card, so you honestly just can't use it. And, um, I mean, diamond neo trachonoid, there's only a mold of it because, yeah, quite annoying. So you'll have to go out and get um, the normal Neo Dragonoid if you want to use this mold. But here's the Dragonoid stats. Double shield, 900B, 2 damage. Diamond Dragonoid. And there isn't even a mold for this Diamond Dragonoid in Evolutions. Uh, which is kind of annoying. 2 energy cost, 1200B and 3 damage. Bit disappointing. Two shields, um, plus two hundred and plus three hundred. Quite simple. And I'll just open this up. So here we go. We have this, and you have to flip out the horn here. And there we go. We don't really have wings for this. Um, because this is strength mode, strength mode Dragonoid, looks quite nice, nice patterns there, quite nice, but still just really annoying that they gave us the wrong cards. And then Sepilius, my favourite Bakugan, so this is a new card. Yes, yeah, so this is a new card for Sepilius Ultra, Ultra Sepilius, which I do kind of find annoying that they changed the Ultra. And it doesn't keep it consistent with the other seasons. The Sepilius is um, in every faction in all around good Bakugan. Not the best, but not bad either. 600B, <clears throat> not too bad. 3 damage, and on a Helix, you get plus 300B. And the cores are Helix and Green Fist. Here's the Diamond Evo 2 energy cost, um, keeping with the low cost um, Evo cards. 700B, not a massive improvement. Uh, another damage, 4 damage, and you get plus 500B. So, yeah, 2 energy for 300B and a damage. Not that bad, but I'd probably use a Nanogon instead. Those are the cards. I'll open this up. There we go. And there's these manual parts here. Just fold these out. And I just, first of all, like to say that the new Ventus faction colors are my favorite. Darkers is my favorite faction, but the faction colors for Ventus are just so good. Look at this red and the green. It's just so amazing. And to have that on Sepilius, which, as I mentioned before, is my favorite Bakugan. Really cool. Just the wings. The head. Tail. So, quite nice. And um, I also got the Elemental Sepilius Ultra. Which has the same stats as the normal one from Geogon Rising. And you can see it starts off with 600 as well. It has two less damage and double green fist. Another green fist instead of that helix. And on a green fist it has plus 600B instead of plus 300B on a helix. But helix is a better core. So I'd say these are kind of the same. And I do love this new art. And here I have the elemental one for a comparison I just fold out these feet here you can see the comparison the new faction colors again looking amazing uh, yeah it's quite nice I have an elemental and a diamond version of Sepilius now which is really good Yeah, so in summary, quite a nice pack. Again, really annoying that the Neo Dragonoid has Dragonoid cards. 
But other than that, it's a really nice pack. And of course, they're diamonds, which is quite rare to get. And especially a three pack, like one diamond itself is really rare. But to get three, amazing. And at first, I didn't like evolutions. Um, and I mean, there are some things, especially with these misprints and mispackages, that really can dampen it. But there is a lot of positives as well. Uh, like really nice Bakugan and we have new gate cards oh and I need to show yeah yeah new gate cards and uh, Nanogan so really nice and that's it for this thanks you guys for watching